Guys, so you probably have seen the barn area and how messy it is. Homestead Boy 1 is having a couple friends over to celebrate his birthday. Um, so he's been cleaning out here. So this whole section right here looks pretty nice. This rebounder right here is one of the things that we got at the auction. Um, so we're getting that put together. The kids are going to have fun being able to throw the ball at it, play catch. If somebody doesn't want to play catch with them, they've got that. I think I mentioned we also got that trampoline. So when you buy things at an auction, it says right on the auction it may be missing pieces. Um, the trampoline, missing a piece for the handle because that trampoline has a handle so you can kind of like jump on it and hold on to the handle. Now we don't need the handle, so I'm not that worried about it. The basketball hoop that we got, let me show you the box for the basketball hoop. So we bought a lifetime basketball hoop. It's a portable basketball hoop. It is this thing right here, okay? Uh, it's about $200 if you buy it new, a little under that. <clears throat> it's missing two sections of the pole. So not like a couple bolts it's missing, it's missing two major sections of the bolt. Where'd you put the um, pole, buddy? Okay, so we put it back over there. Anyway, so I called Lifetime to see if I could buy two replacement um, poles. So the pole comes in three sections. We're missing two of them. I wanted to buy two sections of it. Uh, the guy said, well, since you opened the box, the box had been sealed and they weren't there, I'll just ship them to you for free. Seriously? How do you get better customer service than that? Like, you don't. I was offering to pay for them. They said, nope, they weren't there. We'll just send them to you. Customer for life. So they should be here like in about a week. We'll be able to put that together. And I think we, all of those things, like the basketball hoop, the trampoline, the rebounder, a baseball tee, I got all of them for like $50. I think less than that actually. So not too bad. So my wife just left with the five youngest kids. Homestead Boy One is here with uh, his friends. They are in the barn over there. I'm on hot dog duty. Um, I'm gonna have to do some chores while they're here. So I think the beautiful thing is, it is gorgeous out. It is nice, it is like mid 70s, sunny with a little breeze. So I was really worried that it was gonna be miserable out and, and we're gonna have to try to find something to do inside, but luckily that is not the case. So, soon dinner will be ready and then they can do something else. So, they're having a party. They wanted to be on YouTube. Woo! Woo! Say hi, everybody. Hi, hi Mom, I did it. You did. <laughs> He's not sure what he did, but he did something, so. So I got the cow milked. I moved that bale of hay, because um, I still don't want to let him out on the new pasture yet. So. They're out running around still. I'm gonna start a fire over here so that they can do s'mores. Well, the party is over and I think the kids had a great time. They made s'mores. You can see the beautiful sunset behind me. Um, I figured you'd rather see that than my ugly mug. Uh, the fire is burned down almost all the way. So, it was a great day. I hope you guys had a wonderful day. I really appreciate you guys and uh, I will see you guys in the next video.